Discover the magic of numerology, the power of number two. Were you born on the 2nd, 11th, 20th, or 29th? If so, you're blessed with the powerful energy of the number two. Like, what does it even mean to be a number two? Is it like being the sidekick? Don't worry, it's way more glamorous than that. By the end of this video, you'll be like, OMG, that's so me. So buckle up, grab a drink, and let's get numerological. So why do these numbers matter? Numerology is the belief that the universe runs on certain vibrations. Your number is the frequency you're tuned into. This stuff has been around for centuries. It influences everything from your taste in music to your dating life. If you're a number two, you're basically the diplomat of the universe. You're the peacemaker, the one who says, let's just get along. You're all about harmony and balance. Seriously, you should get like an honorary detective badge or something. Here's why you're awesome. You're super intuitive, like scarily intuitive. You can read people like a book and you always know what to say to make someone feel better. You're also crazy empathetic. You feel everything so deeply. It's like you've got this superpower to absorb other people's emotions. And let's not forget about your loyalty. When you love someone, you love them hard. You're the ride or die friend everyone wishes they had. Basically, you're the Beyonce of friendship. The physical traits of number two. Yup, you are blessed with that amazing hourglass figure. People born under the number two often have these distinct features. First of all, you've got that classic beauty. Think soft features, big, dreamy eyes, and a smile that could launch a thousand ships. You're like the human embodiment of a Renaissance painting. And then there's that hourglass figure. You know what I'm talking about. Number twos tend to have those killer curves in all the right places. It's like the universe just decided to give you a little extra something something. You go girl, but it's not just about looks. You've also got that effortless grace. You move with this elegance that makes everyone else look like they're like wading through peanut butter, the not so great side of number two. But let's be real, no one's perfect, right? Here are a few challenges you might face as a number two. Sometimes all that empathy can be a bit overwhelming. Like you literally feel everyone's feelings and that can be exhausting. It's like having 5G emotional Wi-Fi in a world full of dial-up connections. And then there's the whole people-pleasing thing. You're such a natural giver, but sometimes you forget to put yourself first. Remember, it's okay to say no sometimes. You don't have to be everyone's emotional punching bag. Oh, and one more thing. You can be a little indecisive, like picking a restaurant for dinner. Torture. It's because you see all sides of every situation, which is great until you have to actually make a decision. Where can you crush it as a number two? You're a natural mediator, so any career where you bring people together is your jam. Think HR, counseling, or event planning. You're also a creative powerhouse. Express yourself through art, music, or writing. You'd be amazing at interior design or fashion. Outro. Own your number two. Superpowers. To sum it up, if you're a number two, you're a natural born peacemaker with a heart of gold. You thrive in relationships and teamwork and your ability to feel people's emotions is your superpower. Own your unique energy and let it shine. All right, that's the magic of the number two. If you loved this breakdown, hit that like button, subscribe for more fun with numerology and share this video with your friends to see what their life path number is. Thanks for watching.